Hey guys, it's me Sam and welcome to my tiny Eagle Primark call. Now if you watch my cat short vlog you would have heard me mention that I went to Birmingham yesterday with my daughter. She took me out for a little day trip up to Birmingham as a treat. And um, what I'm going to show you now, and there's only four items, hence why it's such a tiny Eagle Primark haul. I didn't actually buy these. My daughter has treated me to these items. And there's four of them. So, yeah. She didn't pay a lot of money for them because they were all reduced. That is not what it's all about. It's about that she treated me. And I, I enjoyed that. It's nice to be treated sometimes, guys. Now, I'm going to save the best things that she bought me to last. Because, oh my goodness, guys. I'm so happy to have them in my life. You have no idea. You just don't. But you soon will. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to show you that Jess bought for me was this makeup melt. Uh, it's from the PS Pro range. And it's a gel to oil cleanser, which basically removes your waterproof and long wear makeup easily. So, I have seen this quite a few times myself in the Worcester store. I'm denied about buying it. Then I didn't bother buying it because originally they were retailing it at five pounds and I've always been like a missile of water kind of girl. But considering I'd not them down to a pound, Jess agreed. I mean she also picked herself one up as well. But Jess was happy Jess was happy enough to buy me one. So so I have this. And I'm quite looking forward to using it, just to see, you know, just basically what it's all about. Ooh, it smells quite nice. It's quite a sweet scent to it, and it doesn't feel greasy either, so, um, yeah. I'll have to let you guys know how I got on with that. Now, whilst we work with the Birmingham Primark, it's got three, three floors. It makes Worcester look like tiny, like really tiny. And um, obviously we had to check out everything on all four, on all three floors. And while we were looking at the accessories bit of it, um, just to start with me, she has to wear glasses when it comes to reading or doing work on the computer and we, she was trying on glasses and we we seen this one pair and she wanted to know what they look like on me so um here they are excuse this bit guys I haven't took it off yet but um they like got a, a wind kind of 50s vibe going on with them if you can see them a little bit better but she said they really suited me and I can see I can see what I've done which is a bonus because my eyesight's not exactly the best now these were normally retailed at two pounds but they were reduced to a pound so they were very worth getting Especially with the fact that no one can see what she's doing. I mean, I have got another pair of glasses. Which is these ones, which you guys have more than likely seen me wear quite a lot. Because obviously I, I can't read small print without them. But it's always good to have enough pair of glasses. Just think, I mean, I could lose these or they could break. And at least now I've got those other ones, so if that issue ever does occur, I'm sorted. Now the main reason why we were looking in the accessories in the first place is because Jessica was trying to find a particular necklace. And it's got, got the birthstone on it. And uh, unfortunately they didn't have a birthstone, but we actually came across one for my birthday, my birthstone, the month that I was born, which was December. And uh, there it is. It's very pretty. 
I didn't even know what my birthstone actually was. I still don't know the actual name. As you can see, it's below. Very pretty. So uh, she treated me to that. It was two pounds. So she enjoy wearing that. Now, guys, if we cast back to the middle of last year, uh, you may recall that Primark did a dupe of the Chloe Susanna studded leather ankle boots and I already have two lots of these boots. I have them in the black and I have them in the tan. Now the one particular shade I had been looking for these boots in was red. Now I've seen loads of other YouTubers that had found them and I was devastated because every time I kept going back to the Worcester store hoping to find a pair, I couldn't find them. And I just basically gave them up to be perfectly honest. I had just come to accept the fact that they just were not meant to be in my life. That was until yesterday. Now, these boots originally, like the other two, others were retailing at £16 originally. God, guys, do you have no idea? Honestly, I need to scream the entire shop time. <laughs> I'm talking about these guys. I had been looking for these in the red shade, like forever. And when I seen them in my size, and there was only two pairs left as well, I had to have them. I literally begged Jess to get them. I was like, I don't care, I will find the money from somewhere and I will pay you back. There was me thinking that they were retailing still at £16. No, they had reduced them down to £3. It's upside down, you can't see. Look. £3, guys. £3. You have no idea how much of a happy Sam I am at the moment to have these. Oh my God. I can't wait to wear them, but I finally, finally found them, I finally own them, and oh my goodness, guys, I don't think the smell has actually left my face. Every time I've looked at them, I just started grinning from ear to ear again, because I'm so happy to, I made up, and I was, oh, seriously, I must be quite sad, but I don't care. I have them, I finally have them, which means I can stop looking now. Not that I was looking, because like I said, I've given up, but I have them. Oh, God, God, I actually have them. One of the things I noticed about these boots, which was, it's, it's a bit weird, because the other two, I've got the black and the tan ones, they're like a, kind of like a suede kind of effect material. These are more like leather. These are actually more like the, the Suzanne or the Chloe Suzanne boots. They're very, very much more similar. Except the, the, the this bit isn't as long, but I don't care. We don't care because I have them and they're mine and no one is taking them away from me. I'm going to probably end up living in these now for the rest of my life. Not always. Because, as we all know, I have so many boots, it's unbelievable. So, um, so, go. so there we are, guys. Um, that was my tiny equal Primark haul. Uh, I have many thanks to my daughter for treating me to these few items, but put a smile on my face, especially some frigging boots. Oh god, I'm just so excited. <laughs> oh, I'm really happy. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please give this video a thumbs up. If there's anything you'd like to say, if there's anything you'd like to leave in the comments, please do so. I love hearing from you guys, I really do. Oh my god, the cat nearly fell off the windowsill then. Oh, yeah. Jazz, you okay? Did you get a good tits up then? Oh, you poor love. It's all good for me. Oh, bless you, just winked at me. That's so cute. Um, so, yeah, um, if you're new to watching my videos and you'd like to see more of me, hit the subscribe button and come on and join my little family of my tits and... Uh, as always, guys, it's a pleasure to share my life and to record what's going on with you all because 
I love doing Santa, I really do. So, yeah, until I come back again, I'm not quite sure what I'll be back to do, but I will be back soon. So, until then, please do take care of yourselves, and I'm gone. Bye for now.